Hey guys, so I went to Dollar Tree and tried to find the fake lashes that everyone talks about and I looked everywhere and they're like at the end of the aisle and then I saw this. There's literally one. Like why did everyone buy this? Guys, I found the St. Ives cleansing stick. Oh my gosh. And I also went down the laundry section because it smells so good. They have Clorox, Tide, and other brand name stuff. And I also found these light up letters that are usually really expensive, but they're only a dollar and have more mirrors. Couple things you should get from Dollar Tree. Whoop. Magnetic box. Thickening oil. These thin pads. This Arm & Hammer body wash that's also vegan. And these mirrors that are lightweight and great quality. Three amazing beauty products from Dollar Tree you need to get your hands on. Guys, they sell the Pears Soap for your soap brows. This LA Colors highlight blew my mind. It was so buttery soft and look how pigmented it is. This facial hair remover did exactly what it says. It was pretty gentle on the face, but I'm just going to give you a demo on my arm. It definitely removes hair. Three amazing things from the Dollar Tree you need to try right now. Guys, they have this beard and mustache dye that you can use to tint your brows at home. This is an exact dupe to the EOS Shade Cream. It smells amazing and it leaves my skin so soft. This under eye massager was such an amazing find. I like to put it in my fridge and then use it to depuff. Okay, Dollar Tree, I see you. Watermelon facial spray, watermelon facial toner, facial gel hydrator, all paraben free, $3 and change. Three amazing beauty products from Dollar Tree you need to get your hands on part two. This mini razor is so cute. It comes with its own case and it's perfect for traveling. After being so incredibly impressed by the highlight, the LA Colors bronzers did not disappoint. They are so metallic and so pigmented. I'm super obsessed with whitening my teeth and this Reach Essentials whitening pen is perfect for on the go. I mean, you already know why I'm here. I mean, I didn't expect this, but <laughs> okay. Ooh. Gel polish and just in time for spring. Lip oil, <laughs> okay. Wax pencil, mm-hmm. I'll take it. Oh yes. Liquid eyeshadow, okay, y'all really killing me though. Dollar Tree even got tissue. I can't go back to my nail tech, so I guess I'll be taking these off myself. Floral infused lip gloss, okay. Random stuff I buy from Dollar Tree. I need something to do while I'm at home. I mean, besides my homework. I have an art project in mind, so I'm gonna get a few of these. And yes, everything's one dollar. Uh -huh, uh huh. Dollar Tree really doing something though. And then casually check your bank account to make sure you. Okay, so first you're gonna to wanna to get these really cool, simple glass containers from the Dollar Tree, some glue, some Windex, and a paper towel. And then a scrubbing pad. Scrub it all off after you spray it with Windex because, yeah, get the stickers off. Then I take the glue that I got from the Dollar Tree, you let them dry, and flip them over, fill them up, and voila. Who would have guessed the Dollar Tree has some really cool things like this folding brush and mirror. It's the perfect thing to keep in your purse. I love these travel jars. I think they're the perfect thing for a DIY lip scrub. This eye mask is great if you put it in the freezer. It really helps to depuff. Their selection of sleeping eye masks are really cute. I love this wide tooth comb for keeping in my shower and it's perfect that it has a hook. And lastly, their selection of socks are really fun and colorful and I mean, who doesn't want sequels on their socks? I'm out of time, so like if you want to see more. Okay, so first you're gonna to wanna to get these really cool, simple glass containers from the Dollar Tree, some glue, some Windex, and a paper towel. And then a scrubbing pad, scrub it all off after you spray it with Windex because, yeah, get the stickers off. Then I take the glue that I got from the Dollar Tree, you let them dry, and flip them over, fill them up, and voila. Things you need from the Japanese dollar store, Daiso. I've talked about these before, but I'm obsessed. They're ceramic pots for only $1.50, and I love all the designs they come in. I mean, who doesn't love adorable printed Ziploc bags? These are perfect for my daughter's snacks, for goldfish, trail mix, whatever I have. And these also come in a bunch of prints. 
If you ever need affordable pens, come here. They have a huge selection of different colors and these are great for planners. Frames can get pretty expensive if you do a gallery wall, so I love these gorgeous gold ones for only $1.50. Next are these silicone cups, which have so many different uses. They are great for baking, but I personally love to use them for my child during mealtime. They're great for sauces, and I also like that they're washable and reusable. Speaking of food, I love these picks for my daughter's lunches. They're completely unnecessary, but make it a little bit more fun. Lastly, we have this great eyelash curler. It's so cheap and it does really work well at curling my lashes. Please like and follow for more. So here's another look at those LED light up marquee letters. And I also found some string LED lights. Things you need to get from the dollar store. This Apple Watch charging stand would be so much more expensive on Amazon. These barrettes are so cute and they're even marble. I made the mistake of buying one of these on Amazon when you can literally get them for a dollar. These hair ties with pearls are so cute. This nail drill will make doing your nails at home so much easier. This eyelash applicator is a lot nicer than the plastic ones that normally come with eyelashes. This hair scarf is so pretty and only one dollar. And I like getting organizational bins because they're so cheap. Like for part two. What's in the cat section at the Dollar Tree, you might ask? Well, you're just gonna have to come shopping with me to find out. Let's go. Okay, so as you can see, this is the cat section and there's not very much, but you guys, this was an awesome find. I've never seen these at the Dollar Tree before. For a little DIY project, you can buy two of these and super glue the bottom to the top of another one. And you'll have yourself a $2 little dupe for the ones that are on Amazon that cost $9. These animal print little kicker toys are so cute. They've got the furry tails and they also jingle. If you guys know my cat, you know she loves these things. They're awesome. Go get those. They're, they're great. These cat ones are also a really good find at the Dollar Tree. They jingle as well, and they come in so many different colors. Ones like these on Amazon are like 12 bucks. This little four-piece set is really cool for people who just got a cat. It's a great way to figure out what your cat likes without spending a lot of money on toys. These cat clippers at Walmart are $4, so a dollar for these? Ooh, can't beat it. This little bird dude's pretty cool too. He's got a furry tail, and he's also got a refillable catnip pocket. And lastly, if you guys are looking for scratch boards, they got them at the Dollar Tree. More Dollar Tree finds. I picked up more of these pink organizers with the lid. I love organizing my stuff in my room with these, so I found three more. Guys, I've never seen these before, but these are the gray ones, and they also have marble print lids. These are so freaking cute, so I had to get three of them as well. I got this cooling rack, but I'm actually going to organize my eyelashes with this. I found these pantyhose. Normally, they're way more than a dollar, so I kind of just picked it up. I got some rubbing alcohol for when I do my nails. I picked up these scents for my room. If you guys want your room to smell good, I really recommend these. I love the snuggle one. I found this coin purse that's holographic and I want to add this to my car keys. I have bad allergies, so these little tissues are perfect for your purse. And then I kind of just got some allergy medicine to give it a try. I found this graduation cup. I think I'm going to give it to a friend for graduation. I found these giant coloring books. So I got a boy and a girl one for my little cousins. I found this little waffle pen just for my room for fun. Okay guys, this is part two of my Dollar Tree finds. Part one is all about the food. Part two is about all the other fun stuff. And my first thing is these darling lemon plates, hot pads, glasses, and goblets. They are really nice. And can I just ask myself why I spend so much on like foam bowls at Walmart? They're a buck here. And I just spent three bucks on placemats there yesterday. I love this size of comb because it's so chunky that it doesn't take the curls out of my hair. And these brushes, I about died when I saw them. If you've seen my post, it's about two months ago. I'm in a blue robe. I talk about these and just let me tell you, it's for your butt. Okay, why do I pay so much for toothpaste and toothbrushes when I can get them for a dollar? And these things I hear are amazing to go in your closet. He said they sell a ton of them. And these bins, I've never seen them there. They are really great. So anyways, I love the Dollar Tree. I hope you do too. So today's trip to the Dollar Tree was pretty successful. I got some eyebrow soap and some random stuff that I'll show you, which include two elephant decors, which are super cute. I also found some makeup drawers that I'm going to stack and glue together. I thought this was pretty nifty. And I got these really fire highlighters along with some super fun marble cubbies and some mini tweezers, a purple eyeliner this time, and a cool lip balm. I got a bag of sponges just for the beauty blender 
and I also got this highlighter that's pretty fun and some more organizers. Y'all, if you need anything for your kitchen, go to Dollar Tree. All of the dishes you need, plates, cups, bowls, wine glasses, even these cute lemon glasses and a bunch of different kitchen utensils as well as oven mitts only for a dollar each. Just came back from the Dollar Tree. So <laughs> these are things TikTok made me buy, part one. these blemish patches i haven't seen anyone purchase this on tiktok but i saw it on my dollar tree so i thought i'd give it a try it's a vanilla and sugar raspberry plant-based soap these jelly nutrient mists one in a strawberry and one in watermelon and they're super sparkly too so this jelly facial cleanser these repairing honey hair masks this hyaluronic acid serum with vitamin c this coconut and rose milk facial wash. This coconut and rose milk facial mist. This coconut and rose oil face serum. This vanilla sugar and raspberry facial serum. This jelly glow serum. This cute velvet scrunchie. Hey guys, I'm gonna show you how to make a ring light Dollar Tree edition under $20. You're gonna start off with a circular object. I grabbed this foam thing. Grab some white paint and go ahead and paint your ring. Now that my ring is dry, I'm gonna go ahead and open all these LED lights and stick them on. Can't forget the batteries. Just gotta pull this sticky tab on and we are good to go. One down, more to go. This is the ring light with eight LED lights on. It's not the prettiest, but it serves its purpose. Shall we try it out? I'm using no flash, just so you can see. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Like for part two so you can see how I make a stand with it. Mm -hmm. 